Hello friends, welcome back. Now we are going to write a function for user login. Here we have written for create account and uh, so write public function and user login and we need parameter as email and dollar password to give him authentication. Okay, dollar free statement goes to dollar this and connection I will prepare and I'm gonna select select uh, ID comma username comma password comma last login from user where email goes to question mark so this is prepared statement and uh, dollar let's bind the parameter prepared statement and bind param one parameter is only requires string dollar email once the by param parameter is binded we will execute the statement dollar pre statement arrow execute or i will say die function to get the error if there is an error okay, right and now we need the data from database dollar result equals to dollar pre statement arrow sorry 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 get get result get result and then we will have result from uh, that particular row and if dollar result arrow num underscore row let's count the rows and if it is less than one means this email address is not registered and i will return string not registered right and else if it is registered so if it is one so one less than one becomes false and it's it will say not registered am i right yeah it, it becomes false right but if it is uh, less, uh, let's say it is zero, then it also becomes false. It is correct. Dollar and uh, now row get the data. Uh, to get data, I will use dollar result associative array. I need associative array. Fetch associative. Fine. And uh, let's match the password if password underscore verify and input the password in the database row sorry column password now it will match the password and if the password match then i will uh, create session variable for user dollar underscore session and here user id to dollar underscore session sorry sorry it's dollar row and id dollar underscore session user name and it's dollar row user name and dollar underscore session last login dollar row Last login, and once the user is verified and password is matched, then I will update his last login. So the free statement was to this arrow connection arrow repair and date user table and uh, set last underscore log in equals to question mark where last login is question mark where email equals to question mark 
and uh, okay instead of last login is uh, we have given date right i think it should be date and time structure and change so it is date time save cows what is date time last line equals to date and get the so this is the time when user is logged in and we will store that time where where take month hour minute and second and we'll store this last login Okay, it's done. Let's bind the parameter pre statement arrow bind param and pass the string dollar. So, first one is last login updated date and time, and the second one is email. So, parameter binding is done. Let me show you how it is mapping. The last login question mark this will map this last login. And this this question mark will map this dollar email so one by one once the parameter mapping is done and dollar result equals to dollar pre statement arrow execute or die Okay, okay, dollar result true. Then, so let me comment here. Here, we are updating user last login time when. He is performing. So here we are updating user last login time when he is performing. When he is performing login. Now here we will say return. No, not return. We we don't. Yeah, we will return uh, one or maybe two or one. So this function password verify return one and uh, this else part not registered There is a problem. So password not match. Let's save it and let's check it. Okay, I'm going to log in for the this uh, test user. Equal dollar user user log in and the email is swan one the rate is email dot com and password is one two three four five six seven eight nine so let's see what it returns the 
okay first we will get email already exist because of the previous function because of this echo and second we are getting one means uh, we are logged in here we can you can see i have written one and means we are logged in and let me show you in database so the time is updated or not the time is not up, uh, updated it's zero 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 it's updated Here month date Yep. So now it's updated. Time is updated. So this time two hundred seventeen, twelve, twenty-three. Twenty-three is the date, twelve is the month. Time is eleven o'clock. Yeah, it's fine. So it's working, and uh, so the you can see the time is eleven o'clock, twelve minute and ten second. Now do it again. Browse. Now it's now it is eleven o'clock, twelve minute forty seven seconds. So it's working and this is also working let's comment it and uh, okay this is user class and we haven't added anything uh, four dollar underscore session user name yeah it's test so it's working very fine 